50 people have been shot during another violent weekend in Chicago. That despite new efforts to try and curb summer gun violence. Yeah, CBS 2's Eric Cox is live at CPD headquarters where police are going to meet later this morning to discuss what's next here. Good morning, Audrina and Mike. Chicago Police Superintendent Eddie Johnson expected to speak at 930 this morning. He'll be outlining law enforcement's efforts to try and trim down on gun violence following the city's most violent weekend so far this year. 50 people shot, eight of them killed. That includes this quadruple shooting in Streeterville, where I'm told four men between the ages of 25 and 28 were wounded during an illegal party at Lakeshore Park. Police are attributing many of these shootings to gang-related incidents. May marks the beginning of CPD's summer plan. That's a seasonal effort to reduce violence. With the month of May now over, the department's released new crime numbers. Shootings over the course of the first five months of 2019 actually down 13%, according to CPD, when compared to this same time period last year. Overall crime down 9% year to date. The department says their summer plan includes special teams out patrolling CTA trains and stations, bike officers monitoring high traffic areas, and the summer mobile team. That's a group deployed during large events. Police say 19 gun-related arrests and 81 illegal firearms have been confiscated so far since Friday night. Additionally, several other persons of interest are currently being questioned by detectives. We're live outside Chicago Police Headquarters this morning. Eric Cox. CBS 2 News.